The Great Fire of Rome, which occurred in 64 AD, was one of the most catastrophic events in the history of the Roman Empire. The fire destroyed much of the city of Rome, causing widespread devastation and leaving tens of thousands of people homeless. The causes of the fire have been the subject of debate for centuries, with some historians suggesting that it was deliberately started by the Emperor Nero, while others argue that it was simply an accident. Regardless of its cause, the Great Fire of Rome had a profound impact on the city and on the course of Roman history. Rome in the first century AD was a sprawling metropolis, with a population of approximately one million people. The city was home to some of the most impressive architectural and engineering feats of the ancient world, including the Colosseum, the Pantheon, and the Aqueducts. Despite its many marvels, Rome was also a city of great contrasts, with extreme poverty and wealth existing side by side. Much of the city was made up of densely packed tenements, with narrow streets and flimsy wooden buildings. The Great Fire of Rome began on the night of July 18, 64 AD, and quickly spread through the city. The fire is said to have started in the area around the Circus Maximus and was fueled by the strong winds that blew through the city that night. The fire raged for six days, consuming much of the city and leaving thousands of people homeless. Many of the city's most famous buildings and landmarks were destroyed in the fire, including the Temple of Jupiter, the Senate House, and the Temple of Vesta. Despite the efforts of the Roman authorities, who dispatched soldiers to help fight the fire, the blaze could not be contained. Some historians have suggested that the fire was deliberately started by the Emperor Nero, who was said to have watched the fire from the safety of his palace while playing his lyre. The aftermath of the Great Fire of Rome was devastating. Much of the city was in ruins, and tens of thousands of people were left homeless. The Roman authorities quickly set about rebuilding the city, with Nero personally overseeing the reconstruction effort. The rebuilding of Rome was a massive undertaking and involved the construction of new roads, bridges, and buildings. Many of the new buildings were made of brick and concrete, rather than wood, in an effort to prevent future fires. The Great Fire of Rome had a profound impact on the course of Roman history. It was used by Nero as an excuse to launch a brutal crackdown on the Christian community in Rome whom he blamed for the fire. This persecution of the Christians would continue for many years until the Emperor Constantine declared Christianity the official religion of the Roman Empire in the 4th century AD. The Great Fire of Rome was one of the most catastrophic events in the history of the Roman Empire. It destroyed much of the city of Rome, causing widespread devastation and leaving tens of thousands of people homeless. The causes of the fire have been the subject of debate for centuries, but regardless of its cause, the Great Fire had a profound impact on the city of Rome and on the course of Roman history. The rebuilding of Rome after the Great Fire was a massive undertaking and involved the construction of new buildings and infrastructure. The fire also had significant political implications, with Nero using it as an excuse to launch a brutal crackdown on the Christian community in Rome. Today, the Great Fire of Rome remains one of the most iconic events in the history of the Roman Empire and serves as a reminder of the fragility of even the greatest cities and civilizations.